What's going on everyone? How's it going? We are here at Cedar Point. Cedar Point, that's where we are. And we're gonna be doing a little video about last year we did uh, a video called like it's a very depressing day at Cedar mm -hmm. Point or something like that. Because the summer was starting to wind down. It was that time where Cedar Point is only open weekends. Yes. But not Halloween. Yeah, so it's that very awkward period. We're kind of doing a similar video today because already around the park, you start to see decorating for Halloween weekends. You're seeing advertisements for Halloween weekends. So it, it just kind of made me feel like, even though we love Halloween weekends, it just kind of made me feel like, oh my God, that time of year is coming. And as soon as Halloween weekends comes, summer's that means, over. yeah, summer's over. That means that Cedar Point season ends coaster people like us if we want to ride something we got to go down to florida we got to go out to la we got to go far away so really annoying so this is going to be kind of a lightweight depressing vlog so it's not a depressing we're, we're not going to be all depressed it's not a depressing video no. we're not going to be walking around all mopey happy we're going to be happy but we're going to be talking about that transition period what it's like telling you guys if you haven't gotten out to Cedar Point yet this year or whatever your home park is, do it now. Because a lot of parks, like I know Holiday World, they're already down to weekend only operations. Really? Yes. So they're a smaller park in a smaller area. So that's understandable for them. But yeah, get out to your parks. Get out, enjoy summer. So that's what all this is about. This is about enjoying the last bit of summer before that evil winter comes and ruins all our fun. We are going to do Max Air. And like a lot of Fridays, look at how dead this is today. A lot of Fridays have been like this. It's been a really good day to come all years, come on Fridays. Because not huge crowds. The former Tiki Twirl, now Calypso, has been very neglected by us this year. I know. We've only ridden it a couple times. And we got a nice rain ride on Gatekeeper. We got a nice rain ride on Gatekeeper. Yeah, Gatekeeper, the there front, was a nice front drizzle. Row. Front row, rain ride, a drizzle ride. Slight drizzle. Drizzle ride on Gatekeeper. Maybe, maybe we'll get a full-on rain ride here on, on, on Calypso. I think the biggest thing that makes this time of year depressing is because as soon as you start to get into mid-August, it really becomes like the Sunday of this season. And what I mean by that is like, you know Sundays. Sundays, if you're in school, you got, you got school on Monday, normal work, you got work on Monday. So you got the full day, you still got Sunday, you still got that whole day that you can have fun and everything, but you can't help but have that Monday. that Monday in the back of your mind. So it's ending. Yeah, it's it's ending. The weekend is ending. The summer is ending. But the uh wait, you said there's like a 30 or 40% chance of uh, storms all night. Yeah, so here um that that might be driving down the crowds a little bit. Plus Friday evenings have been kind of dead a lot of the year anyway. I hope there's a big storm tonight though. Like storms. Well, we don't want like a big storm while we're here though. Yeah, we got a brain ride. Look what's over there, we got swell tones. <laughs> At least Millennium's fast lane line is empty. It's been coming back to like this area the past like few weeks. 
month or whatever hasn't been the best of times and it's already annoying enough that it has this merge point so far down like you're merging all the way down at the end of the ramp we are coming out an exit that we've never been out before because once have we once we've been out once like a while ago i think but inclement weather is in the area so and they're probably not going to reopen soon and we were next oh, and yeah. inclement weather got in our way a lot of times we like hang out in the station because it's fun but it's yeah because it's going to be for lightning uh probably be a good half an hour or so what do you say half an hour tell us half an hour she went eh, eh, eh. Probably about at least a half an hour. Look at all this stuff. We can watch the underground air gates go. Look, look, at, look at that. It's going. That's not banana. That's not banana. It's raspberry. Look, Hollow Weekend stuff because they're promoting for Hollow Weekends. They're trying to get hiring going on. Correct? Do you want us to work here for Hollow Weekends? Tell everyone watching at home what to do. And this is where you walk by all the rides and see people depressingly getting off the ride or getting out of the line of the ride. And um, you also see all the empty trains going. All the empty trains because they have to cycle the train to get the people off the brake run. Empty trains going everywhere on Air Dragon, Millennium, Arabian, everything. All at once. And they they hurried the show off the stage. Like get off the stage. Yeah, those people want to see the show still. Like start that show. It is raining, so we are looking at yeah, spoiler alert. Plan. The the chance of rain and thunder went up. Yeah. Quite a bit to it actually happened. Yeah, everything's everything's shut down for lightning. So we're walking around Point Plaza and seeing what there is to see. And oddly enough, you know, they have shorts here, but no zipper pockets. Of all the places, hey Cedar Point, look Cedar Point Cedar shorts. Point. Out of all the places, why wouldn't you have zipper pockets? They do have back. They have one. They have one zipper in the back. Right there. See that? Yeah. But you would think they would have all their pockets have zippers because that would only make sense. But Cedar, Cedar Point, Point, take note. <laughs> yeah. Learn learn how to make some clothing. <laughs> the merchants here is really good though because they have a shirt for everything. They had a shirt for Max Shot, which does not exist anymore. They have plates. Smash it. <laughs> Look, Millennium Force is cracked right there. I didn't know it was made by b and And this is new this year. They put this box that moves, and of course it's not moving now that I'm recording. It roars. It's not growing nor moving right now. The monsters come out at night during Hollow Weekends. Just some of the decoration that they're starting to put out. Rides are back open. Maverick is back open. People were cheering. People were screaming. Everyone's excited. You guys all excited? You excited? Are you excited for Maverick? Is this your first time on Maverick? Yes, there you go. Okay, you see all that rain? There's lots of rain. We've been, we're closed down once again. Uh, but we've been sitting here for a little while, debating on what to do, but we're sticking it out for a little while. I mean, we're, we're going to go out there in, like, the pouring rain. Like, there was a whole bunch that you didn't see because we couldn't show anything because it was pouring rain and we were looking for a place to hide out. We ended up hiding out in the tent that over by where Top Thrill 2. Yeah, the singing pumpkins. If you are familiar with Cedar Point Hollow Weekends, they have the singing pumpkins. And we went in that tent and sat there and hung out for a little while but yeah in line for maverick hoping that we can actually ride something today i mean we rode a few things earlier but, but not many because the rain is very hot and lots of lightning in the area there is this huge lightning bolt 
that came all across the sky. It might happen again. It went flat. it went sideways. It's all lightning but like far away, but it's just it really was. all the rides are open. We but just it's so cool. We finally did Maverick after like a two hour long line of waiting for it to open. And then we did, and raining. we did Skyhawk. We did a couple people did Skyhawk for the first time. Look, oh hello. Did you like Skyhawk? I did not like Skyhawk. You didn't like Skyhawk? Like Skyhawk Sky was Max Air's her favorite, so she feels bad no. about that. You but you like Skyhawk. And you like Skyhawk. Okay, and we like Skyhawk. So that's all that matters. That was a big bolt. What? What lightning? What lightning? How are we still open? Or you guys, I should say. We, we saw... That was a big bolt of lightning that just went kapow! We didn't see it! Open up! This has been almost riding nothing all day. But, I don't know. Oh, look. Keep the camera facing there. And I'm gonna... Turn okay, never face the way. Huge lightning bolts. Wait. Watch that, right there. Right boom, there. boom, 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 boom. Look, my water go boom, 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 boom. Three, two, one, one. go. Boom, look at that. See, look at that. He am, called it. Look I am. Uh, oh. I am lightning. What are you, lightning? I'm lightning. What? Lightning, I am lightning. McQueen. <laughs> you guys are getting pretty wet. Look at how wet it is out there. Lots of wetness. Feels like we're on like Thunder Canyon or Snake River Falls or something. It is, yeah, look at this. Everyone's, everyone's wet, you're wet? Wet. This has pretty much been the day. This sums it up. And at the beginning of this video, we talked about how it's depressing right now. This is a depressing time of year. And then this. So how fitting. How fitting that this is. How fitting that this is the end of the video. And this is our day when we're talking about how depressing it is. So that's about it. Are you depressed today? Yeah, depressed. Depression. Are you depressed today? No? You're just out there in the in the water. In the rain. Are you depressed today? Kind of. Very. Look at this park. This is one dead park. Nobody. Nobody here. Okay, that is it for this video. There are constant huge flashes of lightning in front of us. It finally so stopped nice. raining though, so at least we're not walking and pouring rain. Yeah, the lightning but we're already so wet, cool. so. But that's it for this video. Thank you guys for watching. We appreciate it. So, oh, you're coming in to say goodbye. Goodbye. So, that's it. Thank you for watching. Make sure you go down and subscribe to the channel. We appreciate it so much. And if you feel like it, go down into the description and there's a link to a channel membership page. You can be like one of these wonderful people. Right there. And right there, all those people, they get shout outs every single video they get exclusive videos exclusive content pictures all sorts of cool exclusive stuff you should definitely check it out so that is it for this video we'll see you guys next time right here on beach cliff studios see ya